and more from the war in Ukraine in the city of Nikolaev. Hundreds of civilians are determined to defend their country at the cost of their lives. Many are already homeless, while civilians helped other civilians build barricades on the streets. In the bunkers, children of Ukraine are forced to live in the nightmare of war. Fear and bitter memories may haunt them for the rest of their lives. In Dnipro, which is southeast of the capital, Kyiv, people have been creating makeshift bomb shelters and preparing weapons. We have details in this report. Every night now, the air raid sirens will and people scramble for safety. This war is getting uglier as men, women and children cower for another night in the darkness. We don't know where the rocket will fall, what will happen to our city, who will come here and how it will happen in 5 minutes. So for the last few days, we live in the water. This is a place that is awaiting its fate. Meanwhile, the United Nations is moving all non-essential staff and their families. This group, heading for the border, on the road to the south of Ukrainian Amo, rumbles to meet the growing threat. These troops, advancing to reinforce the defense of this region, inside the city, there is an atmosphere of paranoia and suspicion as rumors of Russian spy circulate. This man was detained at gunpoint. And all the time, roads and buildings are being fortified. This is a fight for the soul of this country. I'm here because I think that everyone should unite in our efforts and maybe I can't kill someone, but I can help in other way. These people want to fight, but for now will offer their support in any way they can. Territorial defense has so many support, but they cannot all join at once. David has enrolled and is making Molotov cocktail to defend his city. But as this brutal war descends further, it will be the innocent who will bear the brunt of Russia's aggression. There will be many more frightening nights underground.